Hi, Dan Carlson here, Division Manager of Silent Microscopes based in St. Louis, Missouri. Today I want to show you how to assemble a digital camera onto a surgical microscope. The three component parts, beam splitter, digital adapter, and your DSLR camera. Today we chose our Nikon D7000 and we can put on any Canon EOS Rebel, Sony NEXs, or any kind of Nikon uh, D90 and above. So what we want to do is put on the beam splitter first. Remember all simple thumb screws, remove the binocular head, place the beam splitter which is going to have a 50-50 and a 20-80 side. Remember the 50-50 side is going to give you more light out of the port. So that's really the port that you want to put the digital adapter uh, on. It's going to come with two caps. Just simply remove the caps. Place the digital camera adapter into the port. Tighten your ring down. Okay, so all you do is remove the cap on the Nikon. You're going to have a little white mark on every single one of these DSLR cameras. So what we did was we made a white mark on our digital adapter. Line up the white marks so that it fits firmly and then just rotate until it snaps. Then you'll have the 0 to 220 degree head. and you have your digital camera lined up to the microscope. Siler will do all the settings here in-house and remember in order to make sure that the camera uh, recognizes the microscope you got to turn it to either M and manually do the settings or turn it to A and that automatically should white balance everything in the camera and be able to take good images. If not, contact us at Siler and we have a instructions on how to set each individual camera for your individual microscope because it does matter what kind of light source you have and we do have LED, xenon, halogen, etc.